Respiration Respiration is the cellular metabolic process by which oxygen is taken in, substances are oxidized, energy is released, and carbon dioxide and oxidized aerobic respiration. It occurs in the presence of oxygen. It is carried out in the bodies of almost all living organisms. Here, food in the form of glucose is completely oxidized, leading to the release of carbon dioxide, water, and a large amount of energy. It is a two-step process and occurs in the cytoplasm and mitochondria of a living cell. The chemical reaction of aerobic respiration is glucose plus oxygen gives carbon dioxide plus water plus energy. Anaerobic respiration It occurs in the absence of oxygen. It takes place in some lower organisms like yeast and bacteria. Here, glucose is broken down into alcohol and carbon dioxide. This is also called as fermentation. The chemical equation for anaerobic respiration is glucose gives ethyl alcohol plus carbon dioxide plus energy. Respiratory system. Respiration is a vital process which involves inhalation of oxygen-rich air and exhalation of carbon dioxide. The process of taking in oxygen-rich air, inhalation, and giving out carbon dioxide-rich air, exhalation, is known as breathing. Various organs involved in the process of breathing in humans are nostrils, nasal cavity, windpipe or trachea, bronchi, and lungs. During breathing, the air passes through the nostrils into the nasal cavity. The mucus and hairs present inside the nose filters air and prevents small particles and microorganisms from entering into the body. From the nasal cavity, the air reaches the lungs through the windpipe or trachea. The wall of the trachea is made up of C-shaped incomplete rings of cartilage. Trachea is further divided into two branches. Each branch is called primary bronchi. Air enters the lung with the help of bronchi. Lungs are elastic and spongy organs protected by the rib cage. Within the lungs, the bronchus divides into alveolar ducts. Each alveolar ducts open into alveoli. The exchange of oxygen and carbon dioxide from the blood takes place in the alveoli. Breathing involves the movement of the diaphragm and the rib cage. When we inhale air, the ribs move up and outwards while the diaphragm moves down. The movement increases the space in the chest cavity so that air rushes into the lungs. When we exhale air, ribs move down and inwards and the diaphragm moves up to its initial position. This reduces the size in the chest cavity so that the air is pushed out of the lungs. Let us perform an activity to show that all living beings respire. Take a dish and fill it with water. Dissolve some lime water in the water and leave the mixture for some time. Take the supernatant of the mixture in another jar. Take some lime water Blow some air with the help of a straw in the rest of lime water.